Kenjo Tenji is a Japanese architect who combined traditional Japanese style with modernism. He was also one of the lead architects in the metabolism movement. The metabolism movement was first built up by Kenjo Tenji in a conference meeting in CIAM 59. The group of Japanese architects led by Tenji proposed that a building should experience the same process as a living creature. However, the metabolism movement failed and then became the foundation of Japanese organ- organic architecture due to the misunderstanding of incoming technology era and the wrong focus. Metabolism architecture is a great movement which introduces new building topology and individuality of each module but took place in the appropriate time. Metabolism architecture is a great movement that impelled the new building topology. For example, prefabrication industrial, modern domestic, environmental issue, and natural resources. Japanese metabolism movement from the view of city planning idea gradually transformed into a smaller scale as a residential tower. As what Jenkins brought up, the constant renewal the construction of organic tissue. Metabolist architect dreamed of a new city which once built would provide the environment for true order they saw as an inherent in an advanced industrial society. As the diagram shows, he introduced the individuality of building divided into cells that are attached to the system. Also, those cells can be replaced by new. The capsule tower located in Tokyo is one of the metabolism project. He believed with the base building tower, the system cooperated with more extension units can grow and adapting to the future need. Metabolism 2.0 is his plan for showing the more and more prefabricated pieces attached together. The plans and perspectives of individual cells which he originally wanted is those units can easily attach and disattach to the structure. However, The result of building does not meet his concept due to the location it's in. Once the building was built, some developer bought half the units and people who live there do not want to move out. In fact, the sales has has never been taken by a new one for over 60 years.